tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm going to tell you, I'm tell you a fun story, a little fun story, okay? So I realised I had standards recently. <laughs> didn't know I had standards, you know. I didn't know men really had them. Like, girls, I know you've got standards, you know, you've got boxes you got to tick, there's red flags you're looking for, you know what I mean? Like, hairy back, long fingernails, there's a picture of him holding a fish, you're like, uh-uh. <laughs> no pussy for you. <laughs> Dudes, dudes, we don't really have. Do you have any deal breakers, bro? Any deal breakers? Yeah, no, not really. <laughs> no, maybe one, like, oh, is she here? Like, there's not. There's not a lot. So I ended up going back to this girl place, right? Gorgeous girl, right? So sexy, you know, because it's my story. And, <laughs> and uh, we're in bed, we're almost naked, right? We're in bed, we're almost naked, right? In bed, almost naked. And all of a sudden, she turns to me and she goes, Rory. <laughs> Don't make me laugh. She goes, Rory, there's something I have to tell you. And I was like, oh, fuck! She's got a D! She goes, look, I just broke up with my boyfriend like two days ago, like two days ago. I just broke up with my boyfriend like two days ago. I was like, oh, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> she goes, look, I just want to tell you, though, I just want to be a good person. So I tell you, I just want to be a good person. So I tell you, I just want to be a good person. I was like, baby, you don't need any morals where we're going. <laughs> she goes, no, I just want to tell you, though, I just want to be a good person. So I tell you, I just want to be a good person. I was like, babe, don't worry about it. There's only ever been three good people anyway. That's Jesus. Martin Luther King and Gandhi. <laughs> and she looked me dead in the eyes. This is a true story. She looked me dead in the eyes and she just said, Who's Gandhi? <laughs> I never in my life thought I was going to get cock blocked by a 90 year old Indian man. <laughs> the moment this happened, my penis just folded itself up into an envelope and sent itself away from Vagina Town. <laughs> I had nothing, I had to put all my clothes back on. I was so confused, I called a taxi home. Not an Uber, a fucking taxi! <laughs> my subconscious just kicked in and went 13, 13, 13. <laughs> Dude, I get in this taxi, right, and I'm dying laughing, I'm dying. And I tell the taxi driver the whole story, and then I ask him, I'm like, hey man, do you know who Gandhi is? And the taxi driver was like, yeah. <laughs> I'm Indian. <laughs> so I fucked him. <laughs> Guys, thank you very much for having me. My name is Robert Bob. I'll join the rest of you tonight. Cheers.